In this episode, I'm going to talk about positioning and range depending on your role or your PvP strategy. I know many of you are eager to start on docking, but positioning is one of the biggest and most common mistakes new PvPers do. The best and optimal range varies a lot depending on if you are solo PvPing, such as brawling or ganking, but also depends on what you are dueling against. I will give you more specific ships, fittings and explanations in the different PvP categories such as solo and small gang PvP later on in the upcoming episodes, but I feel like you need to know some of this before we continue. I will show you some examples on ships and what range depending on what fit and tactic you should choose. First off we have the brawling sweeple. The definition of brawling in EVE is kinda blurry, but it can be summarized as you go all in, often in close range. You just make sure that you are close to the target, often within 10 kilometers for a scram and newts if you have, and you just hope to kill the enemy before he can kill you. This is a sweeple with close range guns, passive tank and a scram. With this fit I want to be as close as possible, like 2 kilometers. With this fit I can duel most destroyers and almost all frigates as long as I can catch them with my scram. With this kind of brawling ship I'm very vulnerable to newts or long range ships that can you know, fly faster than you, such as Autrises, which I will explain soon. Here I'm waiting for two faction frigates that I know will jump through, hoping to get a fight. Those frigates want to be at the same range as I do, but since I'm an, in a destroyer and of course in a speed pool, which I consider one of the most unbalanced ships at this time, this would be very easy. So this is an Otrus, which has bonus to Disruptor and Scram range, and are one of the fastest cruisers with the capability of keeping itself away from any efficient nudes and close range brawling ships. I don't have the skills on this character, but I can do over 500 DPS on over 50 km and the disrupt range at 45. This ship are one of the brawling ship's nightmares, with a high DPS and long points and scram range, and speed over 2.8 km per sec. It will stay out of all the enemy newts, scrams and often away from any high DPS optimal range. Here you can see a Gila, which are kind of the same as an Ultras, but without the bonuses to scram and disrupt and doesn't have the same speed, but has the same DPS range as an Ultras. And you can stay well away from the enemy tackles and their optimal ranges with the long range missiles and medium drones. This ship is the perfect one to have as a DPS role in a small gank fleet. Sweep pools and autoses can be used for solo and small gank fleets. In small gank PvP, they have the role of holding the target scrammed or pointed for the main DPS ships, such for example an Omni Navy issue. This ship has many possibilities. It's very fast and it can produce a high DPS on various ranges from 15 km up to 60. So with an Omen Navy issue, with a fit like this, she wants to be over 20 km from the target. And if the target has newts, and high DPS, it should stay over 30 km to be sure not to be scrammed or nuded. But of course, as you can see here, it can be used for small gang PP fleets and if the target doesn't have any nudes or scram, you can actually dare to get close and for example bump if you need to. Here is a Stratius. This one is a close range with newts and dual armor pairs and a cloak. This has a role as a gank and brawl ship. You can easily take down a battleship or battle cruisers or cruiser with newts since you have a cap booster and a high drone DPS. With this fit, you want to be around 8 km from the target and you want to be able to web or newt them. Here I'm out on a ganking trip. As you can see here, you can withstand heavy DPS and thanks to the newts and webs, you can easily kill smaller ships that come too close to you. To summarize, what you should think about is know the range you should be in. I've seen a long range Ishtar with no scram or point or no reason to be closer to the target than 50 km, orbiting and newing Armageddon at 2 km with friendly tackle ships on him. 
if you are able to be out of range of the enemy newts, I mean awesome. If you can't, don't try to get into a battle with a newton ship. If there is no way you can kill him before he kills you, I don't see any point of engaging. If you do have a brawling ship, you will need to learn what target you can engage and who you should warp away from. If you are solo peeping, you want to have some kind of point on the target, so you must be closer than 20 kilometers either way, which kind of makes it a problem. Just remember that your optimal range on your guns doesn't need to be the range you should be at. Good luck and see you on the next episode.